Hey guys, it is me again. Uh, it's good to see you all again tonight. Going to be getting this video in a little bit earlier tonight. I still have to apologize for something though, guys. I am, I am going to have to make it kind of a short video. Um, I just am. I uh, got a lot of stuff going on here. And uh, my nephew's with us again tonight, and he's wanting to watch a movie. So he's in there getting him something to eat again. What a surprise. Um, and, uh, so I told him I'd make my vid while he was in there getting something to eat. So, uh, so yeah, it is good to see you guys again. Like I always say, today is Sunday, July the 11th. I think it's day, guys, I'm not even going to say what day it is because I forgot. I won't know till I go to, <laughs> till I go to post the vid. I forget from one day to the next. Uh, so, uh, whatever day it is, it's a good day in the Lord. So I just want to thank you guys for being here. I uh, had a good day at church today. I hope you guys did as well. hope you guys went to church, or if not, we'll go to church. I hope you at least praise the Lord some today. I hope you, you know, you know, watch the preacher on TV, a good one, or, or, or watch some scripture being read on YouTube or something. I just hope you praise the Lord some way. So anyway, guys, I guess without being able to jibber-jabber too much, I promise you tomorrow night I, I'll, uh, I'll be able to jibber-jabber again. So, uh, without too much ado, we're going to continue on in Romans chapter 5, verse 1. So here we go. Therefore, being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, by whom also we have access by faith into this grace wherein we stand, and rejoice in hope of the glory of God. And not only so, but we glory in tribulations also, knowing that tribulation worketh patience. That's a hard one for me to learn, guys. You know, um, excuse me, guys. I ate some popcorn while ago. You know how you got them little piece of husk in your in your mouth, and it was killing me. Uh, you know, that's the truth. You know, we do learn patience and uh, contentment and a, and a bunch of other good traits during tribulation. And it, it's hard to be, you know, content and happy when you're going through tribulation. But just think that the Lord is, is molding you and strengthening you through it. And patience, experience, and experience hope. And hope maketh not ashamed, because the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost which is given unto us. For when we were yet without strength, in due time Christ died for the ungodly. For scarcely for a righteous man will one die, yet peradventure for a good man some would even dare to die. But God commandeth his love toward us, in that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. You know, it's one of my favorite verses in the Bible right there, you know. But God commandeth his love toward us, in that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. That's just, you know, just think about that, that blows me away. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. For if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God by the death of his Son, much more being reconciled, we shall be saved by his life. You know, that's the truth. We were... You know, we were reconciled by the death of His Son. You know, we, by Him dying and taking our place on the cross, you know, taking the wrath of God, we were saved by His Son dying. I mean, we were reconciled to God by Him dying, but really, we were saved. We're saved by Him living. I mean, the, the, the act of Him dying made it possible, but we are actually saved through Jesus' life. You know, not His death. We're saved through His life. Because if he didn't live, we couldn't live. Anyway, guys, I hope you got something out of this. That's ten verses. Uh, I promise you, tomorrow it'll be longer. Uh, so, uh, good Lord willing, I'll be here. Guys, just keep praying for me. I'm praying for you guys. Let's all pray for each other. Let's keep praying and pray harder. It's what I preached on today at church was about talking about praying and, and fasting and sacrificing. You know, we just don't tend to do that much anymore. We don't pray enough. We don't... We don't give up anything enough. You know, we don't sacrifice ourselves for God. 
you know, we don't fast anymore. And then we wonder why nothing happens, you know. But anyway, guys, I just want to thank you guys for being here. Good Lord willing, I'll be here tomorrow night. And uh, it's good to see you guys again. So good night and God bless.